What do you call a group of cows living in the same place? A community! <laughs> it's so stupid. <laughs> oh, I couldn't not say it, though. I read that earlier today. I was like, God, that's awful, but I have to say it. <laughs> oh, jeez. What's going on, everybody? Your host, Lovely Cheese Pizza here. Welcome back to Let's Play Some More Doom 2. We're in a really bad spot, by the way. There's a whole bunch of chain gunners out here. And I don't know what to do. So I have an idea. We're just going to run forward and see what the hell happens. Because there's a guy over there. A guy over there and a guy over there. Ah! Oh, God. And there's an arch vial out there, too. Oh, my God. This is going to be so bad. Okay, there is a portal down there, though. If we can get down there safely, we may be able to live. Maybe. That's a very big if. Ah! Okay. I don't know... I don't know. We gotta we gotta hit him with rockets right now. I don't even know if I'm even hitting him or not. There we go. Is he dead? Is he dead yet? I don't know if he's dead. I'm going to just go out on blind faith and assume that he is. And now see if we can take out these guys. Ah! No. No, no, no. He must die, damn it. He's gotta go! Okay, he's dead. There's another one over here. Come on, please! Come on! <laughs> yes! And there's totally one down here too, I think. Although I don't know if I'm even going to be able to hit him or not. I'm not going to worry about him. I know there's worse things around this corner. And so we're going to have to put up with that. Oh boy. Please, let there be health around here somewhere. I just know there's something awful in here. Ah! No! God, Arch Vials! No! You stop it right now! God, how much life can he live? Just put an end to it. Put some damn clothes on, too. There's kids that watch this. Oh, jeez. Okay, 10% health and we lived. Oh, no. Come on, come on. Keep him stun locked, damn it. Oh, no, you don't. No, no, no. No, no. No, no, no. No, you stop it right now. I will not have it. I said no. Oh, ho, ho, ho. God, I, I like I had to exert energy for that. <laughs> that was like full on like taxing for my body. That was weird. But we're okay. We are okay. Um speaking of Oh no. Oh no. I hear I hear the the the, the arachnid machines or whatever the hell they call them, like arachnitrons or spy I think the spider masterminds are the big ones. Oh, I don't like these things, man. Where are they at? Where are you? Ah, there you are. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I don't like... Oh, there's there goes one. Is there another one? There, there can't be just one. There's only one. All right. There can be only one! <laughs> oh, man, I love... I absolutely love Aqua Teen Hunger Force. I think the one that's my favorite right now, though, as far as those, uh... Like, the, the Dr. Weird things, <laughs> is totally the... Gentlemen... Behold! More corn! <laughs> I, lo I love that one for some reason. I don't know why, but I do. Okay. Oh, no! He's still alive! Oh, no! Oh, we got him. Oh, my God. That was way too close. I need so badly to get an item. Oh, hold on a minute. Oh, I need that so bad. Oh, no. Okay, where's the portal at? I'm going to go get it. I'm pretty sure that's like the, the Megasphere thing. I need that so bad. I'm pretty sure that'll give me 200% of both things. Oh, baby. That could not have come at a better time. Okay, so let's go into this. And then we just gotta... Oh my god, that's amazing. Yes! Oh, <laughs> Megasphere! Everything is good. I mean, tie me up and let's, let's, uh, let's do the jig, you know? Okay, so other thing we need to do is what's in the other portal I didn't check that out um, by the way I got I have a story to tell you about probably the most frustrating video I think I may have ever seen in my life hey, hey. Ah! no oh no <laughs> I squandered the whole thing <laughs> oh damn it oh I didn't realize there was a guy there well there goes the whole thing <laughs> Oh boy, that sucked so royally. Oh, there's something right here though. A yellow key, I don't have it. Oh, oh no. Well, wait a minute. It's what? Really? 
That just takes me... That, that whole room was just for pain. That's literally all that room was for. It was just for pain and needing a yellow key. Good. Good. Very good. So glad to have that happen. That's just, just peachy. The thing that I need to figure out is exactly how do I get down here? That is a fantastic question. There looks to be... Ah, there's a portal there. And now here I am. Alright, well now I know. I, I was wondering about that. I saw that in the very beginning last episode, and I just didn't know how to get over there. However, I do not feel very confident about this, that they're giving us so much health when there's nothing here. Is there gonna be like a damn cyber demon out here? I got... I, I, I have such a horrible feeling about that. <laughs> if that ends up coming to fruition, we're not gonna be very well equipped for that. I mean, we have... Oh boy. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, there's a reason for all of this. I'm glad that I have plenty of rockets, but I don't feel good about it. This is... this is... What am I hearing? What am I hearing? Is that a spider mastermind, or is it a cyber demon? I don't know which one it is. Where's the big man? It's me, you really, really big man! Oh, God! Okay. Okay, we just... we need to be extremely careful. We'll get to the story in a moment after I... after I take care of the fodder. Where is it? Oh, God, there it is. Yep, that's the big one! Ow! <laughs> oh, there's a couple of them. Oh, they're not that bad. Yeah, that's, that's like, that's like, oh, no, that's the big one. That's the real big one. Ah! Oh, God, no! <laughs> Where did they all come from? <laughs> that's a fantastic question <laughs> right there, too. Oh, well, that sucked. Okay, well, let's do it again. Okay, well, now that now that we kind of know what we're up against, we can, we can do this accordingly. So, I watched, I watched just the most piss-off worthy caliber video that I, that I think I have seen in recent times. And it's just like, it's one of those, like, the, the, the girl that's in the video, she's probably like, she's probably like, I don't know, maybe 20. She kind of sounded like she may have been like 18 or 19, maybe early 20s at best. And, uh, and like, I, okay, I personally love, I love when a plan totally falls apart when you're trying to when you're trying to, like, totally fuck somebody over. It is so great when it falls apart. Okay, here we go. Hello, Mr. Archfoil! I have a present for you. Yeah, how about that? Did you enjoy it? I hope you did, you... I didn't realize that, you know, that just the bane of human existence would actually bleed blood. I have a question for you. Do you bleed? Oh no! Damn it! I love that they call those fireballs and not and not rockets because you know it's not totally obvious that they're absolutely rockets, but that's besides the point. Come on! Come on! Come on! There it is. God, they put two of them right in the same area of each other. How messed up is that? Is he dead? Okay, I think he's dead now. Ah! We're working on nothing here. Um, but yeah, so it was one of those videos because obviously, you know, the whole topic of like police brutality and overstepping their bra uh, over their bra their boundaries. Uh, they're ne definitely not overstepping their blue trees, but their boundaries is, is it's really getting a little out of control these days. Oh my God, jeez, man. Okay, I get it. I totally get it. You're you're a man. You're an empowered man with a with a big gun, and you gotta. You gotta make me feel inferior, cause oh, look at me, I'm a big strapping man. I drink, I drink a whole case of beer by myself. Blah blah. blah. Um, is he dead? I guess he's dead. Okay, cool. But yeah, so what it was was like she was with like one of her friends in the car, and and I I guess what happened, cause it, like it started off a little a little fast. Um, and it, like, starts off with them being pulled over by this cop, and she's, you know, recording it on her cell phone because I'm gonna catch injustice on my phone! Hooray! Oh my god, we totally whiffed on all of those! We whiffed on them all! We whiffed on them all! <laughs> god! <laughs> this is, this is such high stress. <laughs> I can't handle it. This is such a high, just a, just a... It's severely under duress situation right now, and I, I, I don't have... I don't have the, the sense of calm to handle it. 
Um, but anywho, so apparently, like, the kid gets pulled over for not having his license, and uh, and so the cop's just doing his job. You know, he's he's uh, he's doing doing what he's supposed to do as a as an enforcer of the law, and. Oh, no, no, no! Damn it! Oh, I shouldn't have used that. I, I knew it right away that I shouldn't have used that. <laughs> it was such a stupid idea. I should have just used a damn gun. I, it's not like I didn't have ammo for the freaking thing. It's besides the point, though. Okay. So, yeah, he get, gets pulled over for not having for not having his license. Oh, my God. Okay, we got lucky. And, uh... And so, you know, the cops got him outside of the car, you know, up, uh, up against the car door, and, you know telling him the whole thing, and this, this girl, she's like, she's uh, doing like that super empowered thing of, I've got this thing on film, I've got it on film, and he's like, alright, whatever, <laughs> he's like, you know, just let me do my job, and then her, like, her and the cop just start going on like this weird ass, like, she just goes on like this weird ass tangent of like, of how, of, She's, like, accusing him of, like, overstepping his boundaries and how what he's doing is against the law because, because apparently this guy didn't lawfully have to have a license because, because he's a free inhabitant and so he doesn't have to abide by the laws. And he's like, what the hell is a free inhabitant? She's like, and, and like, this is the most, like, idealistic bullcrap I think I've ever heard in my life. But she's like, she's like, a free inhabitant means that that, you know, we're, we, we live in the United States of America, but we don't have to abide by any of its laws. That we're, we're free inhabitants of the earth, and, and, uh, and, and we, can, we can have all of the liberties of, of, of this land, but we don't have to abide by its, by its uh, whatever, whatever rules, uh, or whatever the word was for it. And he's just like, what? <laughs> that was the best part. He's just like, uh... Okay, and uh, and you know he's just like he's just like hey look you're you're impeding on my investigation right now, and I would really like to be able to do my job. So if you would, I you know please you know stop impeding my investigation. And she keeps going on this whole thing about how he needs to contact his his superior officer and all this bullshit because you know he's overstepping the boundary and and this and that and the other. And, uh, okay, we're just gonna go down here. We're not gonna take that other door, because obviously it did not work out last time. So we're just gonna go here. Um, yeah, and he has to, like, he needs to contact his superior officer, because his superior officer will know the laws, and uh, unlike himself, because he's just a stupid, you know, he's just a stupid, bigoted human being that doesn't even know the, the, the confines and, and laws of his own job title and all this stuff. And it's like, dude, come on. And he's just like, look, he's like, I have no reason at this point to, you know, to to pursue any further action with you right now. Like, he's like, look, you, you've done nothing at this point for me to pursue taking action, but you're really treading the line because you're you're getting to the point where, um, where you're impeding my investigation, and at that point, I will have the authority to be able to take action if you do not stop. And so, and she's like, she's like, you can't do that because I'm a free inhabitant and I don't have to follow the law. And he's like, look, um, he's like, look, if you're going to, he's like, I don't know where, I don't know where you're a resident of, but as long as you're in the state of California, you have to abide by the laws. And, uh, oh, no, no, and uh, she's like, no, I don't and like all this stuff. And he's like, look, he's like, I'm going to ask you to get out of the car right now. And, uh, okie dokie. Alright, we're gonna go for the big one. We're going for the big man! Dun, 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 dun. The best part is I still have that, uh... I still have that, that blue sphere thing that I can pick up that will uh, totally help me out. The best part is we also have a whole just absolute ass load of rockets. I mean, we can sit here and play this game all day with you. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. That is a beautiful sight to behold. And I know there's one out here. There is not one out here. There it is. There we go. Alright, that went over significantly better <laughs> than the time before. That was way better. Jeez. Why can't it always be that easy? But yeah, 
so she's just like, she's like, oh, I'll get out of the car, but I'm gonna get out of the car, and I'm gonna go walk down to that house over there. He's like, no, you're you're not gonna do that. He's like, you are not free to go at this point. She's like, yes, I am, because I'm a free inhabitant, I can do whatever I want. He's like, look, as long as you're in this country, and you're in this state, I have authority over you. And she's like, no, you don't, you don't have authority. And, she's, and she just, like, consistently starts getting more and more bitchy, and he's like, all right, you're gonna get out of the car right now. And, uh, and this is the, this is the one thing, this is the one thing about, oh, no, 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 oh, god, we've already been here before, but that wasn't nearly as bad, so that's fine. We still have over 100% health. This is the one thing about girls that scream rape that I do not like. Um, I mean, obviously, it's, it's a very serious issue that is a big, big problem, but, but, the ones that scream it that do not mean it, like, they're using it as a tool to try to get somebody else in serious trouble. That shit's fucked up. That's really extra fucked up. And so he gets her out of the car because he's going, he's like, he's like, I'm going to arrest you right now. And she's like, no, you're not. And he, he, you know, puts his hands on her to put handcuffs on and she starts screaming rape. And at that point, I was like, dude, you motherfucker, you. I am so glad you're getting detained right now. And she's just saying all this stuff about, like, rape and that hurts. You're hurting me. This is illegal. And... You can't do this to me, I didn't do anything wrong. He's like, you're right, you didn't do anything wrong until you impeded my investigation and forced me to do this. I mean, you really gave me no other choice. And she's like, I'm gonna sue you, you have no idea how much trouble you're gonna be in right now. And just all of this stuff, and I'm just sitting here, like, I was actually clapping at my screen, I was like, God, I'm so happy that she's gonna get sent off to the stony lonesome for a while. And like, what, what brought on the wrath? Just nothing. That's the part. Like, had she kept her mouth shut the whole time, because the, it, this had nothing to do with her in the first place, had she just kept her mouth shut, nothing would have happened. Absolutely nothing. Like, she would have she would have walked away from that situation absolutely, you know, problem-free, and everything would have been fine. But no, she had to go with this fucking crazy lunatic rant about this whole free inhabitants bullshit and uh you know pretty much invoked the wrath of doom upon herself with that i have no idea where to go right now this is kind of a problem um but yeah dude i was just like this is the most ridiculous thing i think i have seen in recent memory it is absolute chaos and it's fucking stupid, but at the same time, it is totally hilarious that she tried to get one of those, you know, police brutality, overstepping the boundaries because my friend's getting arrested for not following the law, and now I'm the one going because I did the, I did the, the same damn thing. And I tried to accuse a man of rape when he clearly did not. He was just doing his job because you would not allow him to do it. And, uh, and now your ass is grass, and he is most certainly the mower. And now you get to have that on your conscience for a while, but man, it was that. This is that type of thing that like totally pisses me off, you know. And she just like she kept saying over and over about how it's like in how it's in the law. Like, you're gonna get in so much trouble. You're gonna get fired because you don't even know the. You don't even know the the. the you know, you don't even know how to do your own fucking job and all this stuff. And, you, and like, I gotta give this guy credit. I've gotta give this guy just all the... Whoa. Wow, it's really dark in here all of a sudden. What the hell just happened? Who turned out the lights? Oh, boy. Oh, no! Oh, my God! Jeez! And now these guys are killing each other. <laughs> I was the one that got the final shot! No, you weren't! It was me! Fuck you! <laughs> Oh, man, this level's chaos. Chaos in the chasm, I say. But yeah, that that's that's pretty much what that was. I just, I really felt the need to share that with you guys, because I was just like, dude, this is fucking stupid. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. Oh, but totally worthy of talking about. So, yeah, again, I love, I love when a plan is formulated with, you know, with that type of intention, and it totally fails right before your very eyes because you're the one that, that screwed it up for yourself and like and it's and not a single part of it was the cops fault not one bit not even a single solitary part of it was was his fault that guy was so calm and collected the whole time despite the whole fucking like you know high school screaming fit she threw at him 
he was just like, he was just like, ma'am, please let me do my job, you know, just like totally not just being like the coolest dude in the world, which I don't know how, like there had to have been a certain point in there where he's like, oh God, not one of these fucking people again. Great. But he just like, he didn't even flinch. He was just like, all right, you know, I'm, I'm going to, I'm going to do what I got to do. I'm going to keep a cool head about it. No big deal. And, uh, yeah, dude, that guy, that guy deserves, that guy deserves one of those, one of those you to MVP memes tagged with his, with his Twitter handle on it or whatever, because, uh, that dude is awesome. He deserves all the cool stuff. I hate this part of this level, because it sucks. It is totally not cool. And then, yeah, like, every time you go find an item that's kinda here... Once you get there, then whatever it is, like, like the floor slowly rises up. The south will rise again. Oh. Yep, see, you can, you can hear something, something coming up. Yeah, there it is. There's the floor right there. I just hate that you have to traverse this extra, extra thin thing in order to deal with it all. And, uh, oh, I totally thought that was an arch vial over there for, like, a quick glance. I was like, oh, God. I have to sit here and try to walk on eggshells with this tiny-ass platform? Really? But no, we're, we're good. We're good. So what we're going to do here in just a sec is as soon as we get onto this platform, we're going to call it good. Uh, we're going to do this. We're going to call it good. And when we come back on the next installment of Let's Play Doom 2, we are going to go, we are going to traverse the chasm further, and we're going to see how it all shakes down, but yeah, dude, I, I had to share that with you, it was just, it was such bullshit, I just, I hate people like that, that just think that they're way above the law and everything that exists in it, just because, oh, look at me, I'm, a, I'm, I'm, bare, I'm, I'm at the end of being a teenager, and now I'm an adult, and I know everything, and I'm going to make up this fucking, totally not real type of citizenship that... <laughs> That is just absolute crap. <laughs> and I'm just going to roll with that. And uh, and everybody just has to do everything the way that I want and blah, blah, blah. So, yeah, I'm glad that she got arrested for that shit. It was great. So until then, my friends, this is your host, Lovely Cheese Pizza, saying thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you next time. Take care, everybody. Bye.